The Product Categories Builder is a powerful tool for efficiently organizing inventory by creating and assigning nested product categories. In this video, we'll learn how to manage product categories in RepairDesk. Start by navigating to Store Settings, then to Module Configuration, and then to Manage Product Categories. To create a category, click Add Category and set up a new parent category. For example, enter Phone Cases and save it. To add a child category, select the parent category and click Add Subcategory. Enter iPhone Cases and save it. You can continue adding subcategories under iPhone Cases such as Branded and Generic Cases. You can repeat this process to build out your complete product category hierarchy. To edit any category, click the Edit button next to it. Make your changes and save. To delete a category, click Delete. Remember that deleting a parent category will also remove all its subcategories. Note that a parent category cannot be deleted if products are associated with it. Now, let's explore additional actions you could perform on your categories. Show on POS. This option makes the category visible on the point of sale screen for easier access during checkout. Include in parts for repairs. Enable this option to classify items in the selected category as repair parts which will appear in the parts section when creating tickets. Track as device. If the category involves physical devices, such as mobile phones, you can enable this option to track them. Add commission. You can assign specific commissions to a category so employees can earn commissions on item sales in that category. Retail markup. Set a retail markup that will automatically apply to product. The retail price is calculated based on the cost price, allowing you to define your gross profit margin. Inventory valuation method. You can also choose a valuation method for a product category to ensure accurate inventory valuation for associated products. If you're using our WooCommerce integration, you can sync and map your categories from RepairDesk to your WooCommerce store. Navigate to WooCommerce Integration Settings and click Map Now to sync the categories. Once synced, they will reflect in WooCommerce, ensuring platform consistency. Similarly, if you're using our Shopify integration, you can also sync categories. With Shopify structure, the last subcategory becomes the product type, while the rest are added as product tags. Next to each product category, you'll see an item count. Clicking this count will redirect you to the inventory listing page, automatically applying a filter to that specific category. The filter dropdown displays a category tree, allowing you to refine your search further based on the hierarchy. To assign a category path to a product, go to the inventory listing page and update the item. For example, suppose you have a product like the Defender Series Pro phone case for iPhone 15. In that case, you can assign it to the path phone cases, iPhone cases, branded cases to accurately reflect its classification. Now, let's see how this works when selling a product. On the POS screen, the category structure is key during checkout. Here's how it works. Select the main category, such as phone cases. Choose the child category, iPhone cases. Then select the next child category, branded cases. After selecting the brand Apple and model iPhone 15, Add the product to the cart and check out. This streamlined process makes it easy for staff to find and sell the right products quickly. 
Another advantage of the product category builder is its ability to filter reports based on category paths. For example, in the item Y sales report, you can filter data by categories like phone cases, iPhone cases, branded cases to get detailed insights into sales performance. Please note, you can use the same process to categorize your repair parts inventory, making managing and associating parts with repair jobs easier. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact our support team at support at repairedus.co. Thanks for watching.